Hi everybody, this is Freddy Films and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a homemade camera rig and it's real easy. It takes about 10 to 15 minutes and you want to go ahead and get a set of PVC cutters, a roll of electric tape. You're going to need a couple of PVC pipes, right, a couple of these, get the contractors back. You're going to need the cross, you're going to need a couple of T's, you're going to need some of these and you're also going to need a couple of these. They're called end caps and they go inside of the little fitters. This looks like a little corkscrew. Let's get started. I got two 10 inches piece of PVC pipe. Connected the uh, V shape like that. Then I cut out two 7 inches PVC pipes. I attach those. This is what it looks like. I made two of these. That's why I told you to cut two 10 inches and then cut two seven inches. Then I went ahead and got two more V shapes and I connected to the end. Boom! You're gonna need to make two of these, okay? What I do is I use PVC cement and I'll just glue them together. It dries pretty fast so if you make a mistake you're out of luck. The seven inches that you cut, you're gonna put an end cap to it, okay? Now you got an end cap. See how it looks? It's gonna look a lot cleaner. This is what I've done with mine. I see a lot of people using black spray paint. They chip off and it, it doesn't look professional at all. So what I did is I wrapped both of my pieces with electrical tape. Now keep in mind that the uh, 7 inch piece you cut is going to be on top, okay? The 10 inch is going to be the sidebar, okay? And I'll tell you what these little red things are in here in just a second. You're going to cut two 5 inches long. After you cut your two 5 inches, PVC pipe, you're going to go ahead and attach one side and then the second side and you're going to have something that looks like this. After you wrap with electrical tape, you're going to come up with something like this. You're going to go ahead and attach into one of the L shapes. Now make sure you do not glue this part into your L shape piece, okay? And the reason is is for storage. If you want to put it away, if you want to go ahead and move your, your, your camera while you're filming it, so you attach one side, attach the other side, and bam! You got yourself a rig. See it? Usually I use this with the camera mounted in here. I hold it like this and I can get lower shots or if I'm in a crowd or if I'm somewhere where I need to raise the camera up high. And this is why you do not glue the centerpiece into the L shape, okay? You can flip it upside down like this. There you go. Camera mounts up here. I call this the bicycle handle rig. I got this little red strips in here. I got two little red cable ties. I grabbed an electrical drill and I made holes. Do you see the little holes I made there? I found a shoulder strap for it. So now, I can put it on my shoulder and make sure that the camera ain't going nowhere. Now I'm going to show you guys how to make the adapter so that you can adapt your camera. Okay, you're going to adapt it like that. You see it? So this is how you're going to make the camera adapter. You're going to need one of these. You're going to need an end cap. You're going to go ahead and put the end cap in one side of that connector. You're also going to need a piece like this that's going to attach into that extension piece. So one side you're going to have the little end cap and then the other side you're going to put that little adapter in there. You want to puncture a hole right in the middle of this thing. Go ahead and get your screw, put it in through the hole. Now get your camera, screw it into your camera. Now you got this little thing right there and then we put the screw right in through it. It's steady. Do you see it? It's not shaking. Now that you got this piece done, you got it. 